Every year, the nonprofit operation Walk USA helps patients who can't afford knee or hip replacements get the procedure. In 2021, fewer than 20 patients across the country qualified for the free surgery. But a Bismarck man was one of them, ringing in the new year with a new hip. Reporter Maddie Beer Temple has more on the doctors who made it happen and the patient who's already having an easier time getting around. Not much more than right there. It's been four weeks since Gary Rickey's hip replacement at CHI St. Alexius's Bone and Joint Center. I feel great, you know, and kind of can't wait. I like to fish, you know, and kind of can't wait to get out there and roam the shorelines. This summer, an x ray revealed to Dr. Brian Dahl that Ricky needed a new hip. He had no joint space left, uh, no cartilage left in the hip. Some people are able to tolerate that for a while, but eventually it catches up and it causes so much inflammation and pain. Ricky knew he needed it too. So I've been limping pretty good for the last 10 years, and the past years was even getting worse and worse. When Dr. Dahl realized Ricky was a candidate for Operation Walk USA, he jumped on the opportunity to apply. Since 1996, the nonprofit has helped hundreds who can't afford to get free hip and knee replacements. All the costs are incurred uh, by Operation Walk itself. The implants are free, everyone donates their time, the medicines, the pharmacies. This year, just 18 patients across the U.S. qualified for Operation Walk. Ricky was one of them. When, when I got the word, you know, that, <laughs> that day I was like over, over excited, you know, just about bald out the day, you know. I was so happy. It's the first time here at CHI. It's probably the first one in North Dakota, as far as I know. I'm not sure about that. Um, but we knew that he was a patient that needed it. He was a candidate for it, and we were very happy to have him on board to get it done for him. Ricky is happy to go into the new year with a new hip and gratitude for the team of doctors who made it happen. I like to fish, you know, and if mm -hmm. I catch enough walleyes, you know, it's going to be walleyes for everybody. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Reporting in Bismarck for KX News, Maddie Beer Temple. Dr. Dahl also wanted to give a special thanks to Dr. Anthony Frank at Lifetime of Smiles who helped perform free dental work Ricky needed before the surgery. He says the process was a team effort and is thankful for all involved.